Dr. Jose Simone came to the United States from Cuba just before the freedom flights of the early 60s. He has watched the sinking of ships, the capturing of prisoners, the tiny villages torn apart by the violence of war. But he worries that the United States is being caught in a game of divide and conquer with the Soviet Union. Go from one side, the United States is very close to Latin American country, and for the other side is very close to the England. So I don't think the United States has nothing to gain and everything to lose in this conflict. He's afraid that the United States is making a mistake coming down so firmly on Britain's side. He worries about what that allegiance will do to relations with a country on which the United States has depended in the past to keep the peace in Latin America. But now that the sides have been drawn, he says there is only one thing to do. The only thing we can do at this time, I believe, is to force the British government to look for a specific solution in the, in the island and some participation in the government of the island. Few thought that when the fighting ended, the conflict had resolved itself also. Britain still wants an end to hostilities before returning a group of Argentine military officers to Buenos Aires. But beyond that, some worry that this conflict will produce some dangerous partnerships. The Argentina government is thinking to look for the help and assistance of the Russian. And if this situation is true, it will be the worst thing can happen for the United States and for the whole world. Kathy Mitkiff, The Daily News.